Welcome. This is Jenkins Documentation Office Hours. It is the 9th of May, 2024. Thanks for being here. Topics for today. Two, two builds, two releases, contributor spotlight, uh, version docs project that we should show, and just a reminder on deprecation of Blue Ocean. Bruno, anything else we need to discuss today? Nothing on my side. Thank you, Mark. Okay, so weekly 2.457 was released. Uh, change log is available. Uh, no issues with the release. So looking good and continuing. The next LTS is next Wednesday. And that one, the change log is already merged. And uh, as far as I can tell, the testing has worked very, very well. All of my testing has been very positive with it. Uh, it has a relatively small set of changes that are described in the change log. Any questions on 2.452.1? No, I haven't tested it yet. So <laughs> okay. no question. And it's working great for me. Next is Contributor Spotlight. So Kevin wrote his Contributor Spotlight. And thanks, Kevin, for being a contributor. It's... It's great to have contributors like Kevin, and we're delightful, delighted for him. He's out today, but glad to have him there. So Alyssa is the next one. We're hoping to have Jan Fanachik, and we've got one or two others that are in the queue as well. And Alyssa continues reaching out to contributors. Next topic was version docs, and this one is to show a new site. So here is docs.jenkins.io, a versioned documentation site based on Antora. Notice that here, the, here's the drop down for to allow you to choose a version number. And Ouch. here is the yeah. documentation okay. navigation. That's there's there's, cool. there's still plenty to do here. And it correctly says, look, this is a prototype, right? Go to the real documentation here. And there are, there are all sorts of things that hint that it's a prototype. For instance, you'll find many of these items don't work as expected. Let's pick uh, something different like that one. Yeah, it just reports are not found. So we know that there's work to be done, but it it looks so good. And the navigation is is so nice that I'm looking forward to it and grateful for their ongoing ongoing progress. Any questions there, Bruno? No question. I'm just uh, astonished of the, the path, the journey that uh, led us to having this version of the website. That's super cool. Right. And good to report issues. So so please, as people experiment with it, report along. Oh, I take it back. There is one more item that we should put on the list is that the pipeline steps documentation, pipeline steps doc generator issue with the build step so that's one to talk so deprecation of blue ocean kevin's preparing for and planning for the transition the it's not likely to deprecate in anything less than 12 months there are just uh, a lots a lot of things that are going to need to change in documentation in code to adapt to that deprecation Uh, so we've got lots to do, and the version documentation site is a good choice to, if people need Blue Ocean documentation 18 months from now, they'll be able to look at old Jenkins versions. La last topic, pipeline steps doc generator, and this one is best to show rather than tell. So let's go to this one, this one, and we're going to look at the pipeline documentation, but we're going to look at the steps reference. And there is a step called build. The build steps plugin, which comes with, let's see, builds, here we go. Builds, well, maybe not. Maybe I won't even find it. Huh. Okay, so we're going to use a hyperlink instead. That's why we have issue trackers. Just a minute. This one, the issue is right here. Pipeline steps doc generator. 
So this page, the pipeline build step page, has a document for the step wait for build. However, the plugin provides a build step and documents the build step. And the build step is actually the compelling value of that thing. But, and even better, Kevin did the investigation and found that back in February, in late February of this year, it was still there according to the Internet Wayback Machine. And so here's the here's the page as rendered by the Wayback Machine coming slowly uh, for 29th of February this year. Come on, Wayback Machine, you can do it. Well, maybe it can't. Oh, there we go. Notice there is the build step. Oh, yes. So it's got two steps here in the old page and only one step on the new on the current page. And we've seen this kind of problem before. And in the previous iteration of that problem, it was due to changes in the generator itself. But it's also possible that it's due to changes in the plugin. And then we need, we need to make the changes in whichever place. More investigation is needed. The investigation is rather painful because it involves bisecting by building the doc site to identify where the failure occurred then deciding did that failure happen because of a change in the generator or a change in the plugin source code wow okay yes yeah, so the generation of the website takes approximately from <laughs> five to mm -mm, whatever minutes so i guess bisecting that would be a heavy task well and and this one is this is a, only a subset of the website but yes the subsite that is this the subsite that's done is still as you said quite expensive to generate and it's a 5 to 10 or even potentially 15 minute task to to run it so kevin started it but needs more work more needs a needs bisect to identify the problem and then the way we handle it last time then it needs a test that checks the problem is fixed and then needs a fix to resolve the problem. And that's right now in this pipeline step stock generator repository, the number of tests is tiny. And you can imagine the number of tests could be potentially very, very large to check. The only reason the tests exist right now is because I wrote one for the last problem that we encountered. Oh, okay. <laughs> And so, and that, that test is embarrassingly simple, really surprisingly trivial. It checks for exactly the problem that we found. And obviously it didn't check for this problem. So that's, that's the story there. Any questions there? No, no, Mark. Thank you. All right. Let's call ourselves done for today. Unless you have other topics, Bruno. I don't. Thank you. Okay. Thanks.